स्टूडेंट्स लेट एस सी बोकन यूनिवर्सिटी प्रैक्टिस टेस्ट इन दिस वीडियो वी विल डिस्कस सम क्वेश्चंस फ्रॉम प्रैक्टिस टेस्ट ऑफ दिस बोकन यूनिवर्सिटी सो लेट एस सी द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन आई विल ट्राई टू एक्सप्लेन थ्योरी अलोंग विद द सॉल्यूशन आल्सो सो द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज आई राइड अ सर्टेन डिस्टेंस ऑन माई बाइसिकल इन एटीन मिनट्स right there is a certain distance it means there is a fixed distance let us suppose this is a point a this is a point b and this distance is constant there is certain distance what is the meaning of this certain distance distance is constant and this distance is traveled in 18 minutes right if i increase my average speed by 50% now the question is saying if uh, he increase the speed by 50% by how much time will it take me to cover the same distance then uh, the question ask how much time now it required to cover the same distance if he increase uh, his speed by 50% see this is a very conceptual question so the the basic the background concept needs this concept let me explain see the background concept is if the product of any two number right if if the product of any two number is constant right and if we increase any one quantity then to remain it to uh, keep it constant the other quantity should be decreased that the first concept the second you can think similarly if the first quantity will decrease the second quantity should be increased to keep the product as constant now how much increase and how much decrease so that's uh, we can understood or uh, remember with the uh, simple logic let us suppose this is a cross b is equals to constant and let us suppose uh, a is increased by any ratio let us suppose 3 by 5 a is increased by a ratio 3 is to 5 what is the meaning of this 3 by 5 uh you can also convert it into percentage but we have to go from the per, uh, fractional value for example if we talk about this question we have given 50% increment so what is the meaning of fractional uh, uh meaning of 50% so it is 50 upon 100 that is the 1 by 2 right so let us solve the question simultaneously so according to question any quantity is increased by 1 by 2 so the next requirement is by how much fraction the second quantity should be decreased to keep the product constant the simple logic or the simple um, you can say trick is see if your fraction is in, uh, has to be decreased if the fraction has to be decreased for example i have to decrease here 1 by 2 so to decrease the fractional value i have to increase the numerator uh, denominator to decrease fraction increase the denominator so if my first number is get increased by 1 by 2 the second number should be decreased by 1 upon 1 plus 2 see the concept is we have to change only the denominator either to increase or either to decrease so if we want to decrease the value so numerator should be uh, so denominator should be high so you have to add numerator plus denominator so its other value should be decreased by 1 by 2 it means so if we try to uh, apply the same concept uh, in this example if my first quantity is getting increased by 3 by 5 so to keep the product constant i have to decrease the second quantity and the second quantity decreased by 3 upon 3 plus 5 that is the 3 by 8 so second quantity should be decreased by 8 now come back to the question see what was the statement see now please see we know speed into time will be equals to distance we know speed into time is equals to distance and for this question my distance is constant because it is saying that it is a certain distance 
so its distance so now if speed will be increased time will be decreased so how much speed increase it's 50 percent 50 percent means 1 by 2 so speed is getting increased by 1 by 2 so time will be decreased by 1 plus 1 by 2 so it will be decreased by 1 by 3 right so right so how much time so now the question is saying how much time will it take me to cover the same distance see any quantity is getting getting decreased by 1 by 3 what does it mean any quantity is getting decreased by 1 by 3 what does it mean it means if initial if initial value was 3 then decrease decrement was 1 so final value will be 2 that's the 3 minus 1 that's the meaning of this I'm saying the value decrees by 1 by 3. It means if the initial value will be 3, decrement will be 1 and final value will be 2. Right. Now, according to question, my initial value was, what was the initial time? He was taking 18 minutes. So initially he was taking 18 minutes. So now compare it. That's the ratio, uh, rule of ratio. 3 units or you can say 3 units correspond to 18 minutes. So, one unit will correspond to 6 minutes, right? So, what do we have to find? How much time will it take me to cover the same distance? So, the same distance will be covered by, how much time uh, will it take to cover the same distance? So, final unit is 2 unit, right? So, the final time will be 2 into 6 because the one unit correspond to 6 minutes. So, answer will be 12 minutes. So, its answer will be this 12 minutes see if uh, it uh, requires how much time gets decreased by how much time it will decrease so decrement is one unit so you can say it's correspond to six minutes so in this question you should have the knowledge of percentage you should have the knowledge of ratio and proportion then you can solve this question very easily see i am i have taken so much time because i have to explain in detail but if you have the knowledge you can solve it in a minute or we can say in a 30 seconds maximum right so uh, we will see the next question in the next video thank you thanks for watching